help us to have a look at how farmers could use drones to optimise their irrigation practices. What we found was that it's really easy to get a provider to use a drone to take colour photos of your paddock and those colour photos can help you identify areas of waterlogging or where the pasture is not growing well. Um, you can identify different colours of the pasture as well so it can help you ground truth what you've got on the ground and what, what you see from those pictures. It's also quite easy to get um, a drone provider to provide you with an NDVI image, which is a colour image that also gives you a representation of plant vigour. So it'll be multicoloured and it identifies high, highly vigorous plants compared to either no plant in that spot or no vigour. And that allows you to again get a bit more of an idea about how those plants are growing across the pivot and whether there's key areas that aren't growing as well as they could be. One of the key questions that the farmer participants in Smarter Irrigation asked though was could these pictures be used to help us identify how many kilos of, bio, of, of dry matter you're growing on the pivot because that, that's one of the big questions we've got around optimising irrigation is are we missing out on some of the pasture we could be growing. Unfortunately at this stage the, the images that we can get from drones aren't able to estimate plant biomass for us so it's still a big gap. Um, but there is research going on in a number of different groups to try and develop a methodology that enables us to take photographs, whether they be infrared or NDVI or just plain colour, and be analysed to give us a biomass um, outcome. So one of the projects that Dairy SA worked with was to talk to Alison McCarthy from the National Centre for Engineering and Agriculture. She's using mobile phone cameras on centre pivots to take a colour photograph and then uses the computer system that they've got to do a leaf length analysis to then estimate biomass. So that's one of a number of technologies that show potential for the future. Mm -hmm.